All right, welcome to Mimi's Science Lab. Now this is using a microscope, and then I'll show you in real. But it's always fun to look at things under the microscope. They're so much bigger, and you'll see so many details. Now believe it or not, this is a young yellow jacket bee. Look at the colors. Look how clear the wings are. Got himself some clear wings right there. Isn't that just neat? It is so interesting. Yeah, I just got rid of that little glare I had there. Ah, I still see some of it. Look at that. Isn't that interesting? You can see all the little details of them. Okay. When they sting you, boy, it feels like uh, it hurts and it feels like it's burning and you'll scratch and as you scratch it swells the area up. You can put an ice cube in a sandwich bag and put it on the swelling area and that helps an awful lot. We live out in the country. We're getting used to all this stuff here. <laughs> okay. Look how you can see the waistline. Exactly where his waist is right there. Wow, look at that details. That's the end of them. Look at that. Call it a yellow jacket only because it looks like a crossing guard colors, the black and the yellow. Got the beautiful wings like this. Look at that. And I see right through the wings and everything. Amazing. All the details you can see in a bee. This little microscope hooks up to the computer and then you can just see it on the computer and move it around to how big you want it. Really neat. Okay, now yellow jacket. Each bee can sting more than once injecting venom. And of course it causes that burn swelling and stuff. They are very aggressive insects, but provide protein to developing colonies. Huh. The diet is mostly sugar and meats. And they are good workers in your garden to pollinate your vegetables. All right, so they do have a purpose. Just stay the heck out of their way. <laughs> okay, you get to look at these little antennas. Uh, still learning how to handle this. Look at that. They look so big, but they're really not. They're so thin, it's unreal. What a beautiful sight. Let me flip them over for you. Look at all the wings. They got four wings. Let me see. Maybe I can just flip you with my finger so we can see the underneath of him. Here's the underneath. Look at the eyes looking right at you. Ain't that something? Legs are crossed. His eyes are looking at you. See underneath of his whole body and his wings. Well, look at that. Here's looking at you. <laughs> All right. Hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. 
be sure to get all your other friends. These are mostly for like teenagers and stuff to get people interested in science because it's very obvious we need more scientists. So if you see how you can just blow it right up with a microscope to be able to see all the details, that might pique your curiosity. And you know, parents, this be a good Christmas gift under $40 be perfect and they can check everything out in their room every fly every mosquito they can check everything out and look under the microscope or be like me living out in the country there are windowsills there are vehicles that sat there for a while you know like the plow truck you don't need it till winter time but on the dash that's where they all go so open up a vehicle and grab them they're on the windowsills in the garage and the barns. You can find them all over the place. Very easy to find. And look what you can do. So hopefully we can get some future scientists. The curiosity of what something real small that you hardly can see will look like under a microscope. All right. Be sure to sub me now. And share the video. Now let me show you what he looks like for real. You've seen it under the microscope. Let me show you this tiny, tiny little one. This is all he is. Alright. There he is. Alright, bye bye now.